how understanding this key fertility factor could increase your chances of getting pregnant. Thanks for opting in to get Key Fertility Factor 1. Hi, I'm Dr. Alex Perry, Chinese medicine doctor and founder of The Perry Center. Welcome to The Fertility Factor. We've been helping women and their partners start and grow their families with great success, and I'm really excited to be able to share the first of the three key fertility factors with you. I've chosen this story because it illustrates one of the very basic but often overlooked reasons why couples aren't falling pregnant, and perhaps it's part of your journey also. In fact, in my experience, even some of the specialist fertility clinics overlook this key fertility factor. So it's not your fault if it's been an issue for you too. So what is this fertility factor? Well, the fertility factor is timing. Let me introduce you to our couple. I can't tell you their names, but they're super nice. They've been trying really hard to start a family and they've had no luck at all so far. In fact, they've been trying now for about 12 months and their GP has just referred them to a fertility specialist. And it was about the same time that this couple sought my help. One of the very first things we talked about was fertility factor one, timing. So what does this mean, timing? Well, actually timing has three parts. Part one is, are you ovulating? Part two is, if so, when? And how do you know? And is it happening consistently? And part three, are you having sex at the right time in order to give yourself the best chance of falling pregnant? Now, all of this sounds pretty obvious, right? But this couple, like many other patients I see, really had very little idea of if and when they were actually ovulating, let alone whether they were having their sex at the right time. So they were really, you know, a bit unsure of whether they were getting their timing right. And this is a very basic baby-making factor. But why is timing so critical? Well, did you know that when you ovulate, you've only got about eight to 12 hours to fertilize your egg? Many couples I see are actually really surprised by this fact. Some are even shocked, and certainly very few know that this is the case. So if you're not 100% clear on if and when you're ovulating, you may well be leaving falling pregnant to chance. Now, to me, this is just too important to leave to chance alone. So when we started working with this particular couple, we employed three really simple, really effective do-it-at-home tests to determine if and when she was actually ovulating. And what we discovered was really interesting. You see, she'd presumed that she was ovulating on day 14 because the app on her phone told her that was the case, and so did Dr. Google. Now, one of the three tests showed that she actually had a really strong and long LH surge. In fact, for her, it was lasting almost a week. So instead of ovulating on day 14, we discovered she was actually ovulating closer to day 17. Now, what did this discovery mean for this particular couple? Well, it meant potentially that in the 12 months prior, when they were trying to conceive, the timing had always been just slightly out. In fact, you know, we proved this because once we had discovered that her fertile window was a little bit later than she'd expected, and we adjusted their timing, this couple actually fell pregnant quite quickly. Now, it's not always as simple as that, but getting your timing right is absolutely critical. Because if your timing's wrong, the sperm and the egg may never even have the chance to meet, let alone get together and um, conceive. That's how important timing is. It's a simple process, but it needs a bit of analyzing. It's super important to be clear and confident that you are absolutely getting your timing right. And it may be the difference between falling pregnant or not. So now I hope you understand just how important getting the timing right is. And if it's okay, I'd like to show you a way to be confident that you, just like the couple in the case study, are getting it right for yourselves. Specifically, it's called Solving the Fertility Puzzle. It's our Fertility Factor introductory course. It's actually the same process we go through with our patients in the clinic. So it's tried and it's tested and I see that it works over and over again. So why are the three fertility factors so important? Well, as you know, Fertility Factor 1 on its own, timing is super critical. Taking you through that part of the course alone could dramatically increase your chances. So my goal really is to get you set up completely in the next couple of weeks so you're going to be confident that you're ticking off these key fertility factors for yourself. So deploying the same training and tracking that we use in the clinic will empower you to be better informed no matter where you are and what level of knowledge you currently have. Like I said, there are three key fertility factors. They're not hard to learn, but they're powerful when you deploy them. Fertility factor one. Well, look, we're gonna cover timing. We'll talk you through how to use our simple three-part tracking system and how to make it fit into your busy schedule. 
And look, I'm also going to show you a tailored way that you can have me analyze it for you, but more about that later. In Fertility Factor 2, we're going to introduce the main reason why most couples coming to see me aren't falling pregnant and what to do about it. And in the final step, Fertility Factor 3, we're going to cover one of the most overlooked parts of your fertility puzzle. Can you guess what it is? It's actually your man. Specifically, we'll cover exactly what diet he should be on to improve sperm quality, the things he should be avoiding in his life, and when is the best time to get him tested. Again, this is the same three fertility factors my team uses to make sure our fertility patients in the clinic are really confident that they are doing everything they can to maximize their chances of falling pregnant on their own. And personally, I wouldn't attempt to start treating any of my patients without first going through this process. Especially if you are, as most couples are, trying to fall pregnant on your own. Now, have you ever heard of the expression, you know, keep doing the same stuff tends to end up with the same results? Well, that could be part of making it harder for you guys to fall pregnant. For most couples, it's just a matter of start trying, you know, and when it's not happening, what do you do differently in order to get the different outcome that you desire? You see, we actually do this stuff in the clinic day in, day out, and it's why the fertility factor is a simple, easy to follow plan to help you get the same results we get for our patients. Until now, the three fertility factors were something that we only did with patients at the Perry Center, but for the first time, I'm making it available for you too. The three fertility factor program is just $7, a fraction of the cost of visiting us at the Perry Center. So if you'd like to start working with me today to maximize your chances of falling pregnant, click the add to cart button and start planning your pregnancy today. And you know what, I'll give you instant access so you can make a start right now. And in case you're wondering, like all of our trainings, this one is perfected, uh, protected rather by our 30 day, no questions asked guarantee. In other words, if you're not happy for any reason, just let me know and we'll give you your $7 back. We don't think you'll need to use it, but just like trying on a pair of clothes at the store, we want to make sure this is the right fit for you. You either get the information you're after or you get your money back. It's as simple as that. So click the button below and start your journey to parenthood today. And if you're ready to make an appointment, please call me at the clinic on 61624950. And I'll be more than happy to personally answer your questions and to make an appointment time for you. I'm Dr. Alex Perry, Chinese medicine doctor, founder of the Perry Center, and I look forward to meeting you soon.